Hi guys, welcome back to Yaya's Craft House. Today we're back with another Timu miniature haul. It's been a little bit since I've done a Timu haul, so I'm pretty excited to jump right in. First up, we have this little black and white checkered outfit. It is a little skirt, a strapless top, and then two sleeves that are not attached. Here it is on a made to move Barbie. I wasn't sure if the sleeves were meant to be down on the arms or up on the shoulders. I'm assuming you could wear it either way, but I think it's pretty cute and the quality is pretty good. I wanted to try it on a curvy made to move Barbie and I remembered I had bought this new one from Target. So let's take her out of the box and try it on her. The skirt and the top, neither one would close all the way in the back. Next up we have this little side table. I think it's really cute and I'm really happy with it for the price. I think it was it was under $3. The top of the table reminds me of those little coasters you can put in your car cup holders. I'm pretty happy with this and I think I'll I'll put it in the stall room right here. This one took me a minute to figure out what it was. I was not expecting to have to put this together, but it is a little rolling cart for the dollhouse. I am pretty bummed one of the wheels on mine is uh, not staying on, so I am gonna have to hot glue it. This is a little succulent plant set. Um, I did buy one of these once before. This one is different, and I, I think I like this one better. I think it's really cute. I was pretty excited about this one. It is a little stand to hang little coffee cups on. I think it's really cute and I'm, I'm really happy with this one. The cups may be just a tad bit small for the dolls, but I think it works. Next, I got these little miniature hair clips. I was hoping they would look cute in the doll's hair, kind of pulled back or, you know, however you want to style it. And they feel like they're really good quality. And I was super happy I got two of them and they were just a little over a dollar. I tried styling the doll's hair really quick. Um, it kind of bounced out of it. Next we have a set of three little miniature staplers. These are really small and the bottom even moves to where it looks like you could act like you were stapling a paper. Next up I got this little four pack of little Pringle cans. I think they're really cute. I'm pretty happy with them. This is another outfit for the dolls. I didn't recognize this uh, when I first opened it. It looked kind of different than what I was expecting, but it is a complete outfit. It comes with a pair of black pants, a, a white shirt with the belt attached, a pair of black heels, black glasses, and then it comes with a little cloth bag. I think the outfit's okay. It's not my favorite outfit. Uh, the pants do seem a little big on the doll, so I'm pretty sure they'll go on the, the curvy doll with no problem. Here's the outfit on the curvy doll. Uh, pants fit really good. The shirt goes on, but it did not want to close all the way in the back. 
One thing about me is I'm blind. Like, unless I have reading glasses on, it's hard for me to see things. So I actually thought I was ordering a little bench with this one. I think it's more so supposed to be like a little hamper. But it is too small for the dolls. But that's my fault. I just, I, I probably didn't have my glasses on. Next up we have these little resin plates. I ordered these thinking the panda, the fox, I thought they could be little plates for Chelsea and uh, for the for the two younger girls. And I, I do think the panda and the fox work, but the other one's not really. This is a miniature little scale, and I knew ordering it that it said 112th scale, um, so it was a gamble, and unfortunately it does look like it's too small. Here it is with a Stacy doll, and you can see her feet are as big as the whole scale. Next, I got the doll some toilet paper. This was a whole little set. I'm not sure how many are in there for maybe 10 rolls. It was like $2.50. This is another outfit I didn't recognize when I first opened it. I think the whole, the belt of the dress was throwing me off. And this piece, I thought, I, I, I don't know, I was confused. I wasn't sure if this was a little skirt that went over the dress. I had to pull the picture up to see that they're actually using this as like a kind of like a sideways cape. I won't be using it like that. Yeah, I'm, I'm not a fan of the way it looks. I do think the dress is pretty. I don't like the belt on the dress, but if you could take a piece of ribbon or something and cover it up, I think it would be okay. The little cape does fit the Stacy doll as a jean skirt, um, but it is with the big Velcro in the back, it does make it quite bulky. These are some miniature alcohol bottles. I got these for a project I'm gonna be doing soon, but I think they're pretty cute and I think they'll work perfectly in my project. This little rug, I think it says a cat rug. It, to me, it looks more like a bear, but I think it's really cute. I'm gonna put it in one of the girls' rooms. It reminds me of like a bathroom rug, but I think it's I think it's pretty cute. This is a set of four little mini cakes, kind of shaped like trees. I think they're cute. They are a little small for the dolls for um, like a cake, but I think even if you use them as a decoration around Christmas time, I think it would still look cute. This is another little alcohol bottle, and the reason I got it is because it comes with two little cups that look like little drinks, and it's also for the future project that I'm gonna be working on. Next up, we have another outfit. This outfit is a long khaki skirt and a black and white striped top. I think it's pretty good, and the quality seems pretty good. I tried it on the curvy made to move doll first. The The skirt doesn't fasten in the back, but I, I still think it could work if you were just taking pictures of the doll. And here it is on the other made to move doll. I think it's really cute. It's probably my favorite outfit that I got in this order. Next, we have probably my favorite item that I got in this little haul. It is a miniature desk calendar that actually works. I think it's adorable and would look so cute in a little office or even sitting out on a counter. I just, I love it so much. I ordered these little boots hoping they would fit. I really wanted to turn them into miniature like hunter boots, paint the little hunter logo on the front. Unfortunately, they don't fit any of the dolls. And when I got to looking at them, they don't even have an opening past the leg part. Lastly, we have another outfit. This is a pink sweater dress that has a little love pendant on it. It comes with black knee-high socks, white tennis shoes, and a matching pink hat. 
I'm pretty sure I ordered this one for the socks. I don't have any knee socks and I think they look so cute on the dolls. Here it is on the Made to Move Barbie. I think it's cute. Maybe not with the white shoes, but I think it's it's an okay outfit. I would like to tear the little handmade tag off the hat. Here it is on the curvy Barbie. I think it looks really cute on her as well. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the thumbs up below and subscribe for more videos, and I'll see you back here soon.